Ever wonder why Wankel rotary engines can make so much power despite being tiny? Unlike most internal combustion engines with pistons, rotaries don't even have pistons. Instead, they use a cool, triangular metal piece called a rotor to do all the combustion magic. And that's where the secret to their incredible power lies. So, here's the deal, each side of that rotor handles its own combustion process. While one side is sucking in air and fuel, another side is firing, and the third side is expelling exhaust. All of this happens simultaneously. Think of it this way, one single rotor is basically the equivalent of a three-cylinder piston engine. And if you have a rotary engine with two rotors, like the Mazda 13B, that's like having a six-cylinder piston engine packed into a much smaller space. On top of that, the rotor in a rotary engine can go through the combustion process every 120 degrees, or a third of a turn of the eccentric shaft. That's way faster than a two-stroke engine, which needs a full 360-degree crankshaft rotation, or a four-stroke engine, which needs a whopping 720 degrees. So, the fact that a rotary engine's rotor can complete three combustion cycles in just one rotation is precisely why these engines can generate so much power, even with their compact size and smaller displacement. Pretty neat, huh? Follow if you like this video and see you next time.